Hi, this is Adam Gray, uh, Don Calvert. This is the machine we've been talking about. You wanted a video, so we're going to make you one. Uh, we'll come in and walk around the machine a little bit. I'll take the camera from my wife and we'll point out what we're looking at. So here's the rear end and the tracks. See the tracks are in really excellent shape. They're at least 85-90%. Sprockets are also showing very little wear. 85% or better. Rollers are in good shape. Nice and smooth. These rollers are in good shape. None of them's thin, none of them wobble. No grease, grease leaking out of the bearings underside of the tracks are in real good shape. They don't show any gouges or scuffing. Front rollers look good. Nice and smooth. I'm going to get in your shadow, I guess. Got ride control on it. It's a vertical lift. All the pins are nice and tight. No damage to the back doors or cowlings. Everything opens up perfectly. We'll open up the back doors and have a look. Good new filters. Got less than a hundred hours on them. You can look down inside there if you can. Everything's good and clean. Belts are tight. Fan blades are all intact. No whiteness on the antifreeze cap. No milky condensation on the oil breather or the oil cap. All this was replaced at 1,087 hours. Inner one was replaced at 1,087 hours. Nice and clean inside there. Inner filter looks brand new. Let's see this one. filters, 1,087 hours. Hydraulic wheel filler. No indication of condensation in there. No leaks around the radiators. We've had some rain. You can see a little bit of wetness from the water we've had. It's been awful as far as that goes. But around the bottoms, no leaks. No nothing coming out of here as far as antifreeze. Fins are all nice and straight. No issues. Coolant level's good. A 
Is the oil level? Nice, good looking oil. This is the AC condenser. Everything's nice and clean. Air conditioner works really well. No issues when it was 100 degrees outside. And we're on the other side of the machine. See the tracks are just as good. Sprockets are just as good. Very, very little wear. Rollers are good. No indication of any naughtiness whatsoever. are good. There's not a gouge anywhere on these tracks. They were brand new and put to work in dirt. This bucket is brand new. It's probably got 10 hours of use that we've put on it since we've had it. 84 inches. With a smooth edge. It is an aim bucket. Auxiliary hydraulics is a standard flow. Cylinders don't show any signs of wetness anywhere. Everything's sealed up really tight. Hydraulic coupler. Windshield's good, lights are all good. Wipers work. Right here is the only issue on the machine. See, it's a little bit bowed right here where somebody has rubbed up against something but you can barely notice it okay let's go inside great seat and so hardly anywhere all the windows are intact no cracks all the screens work, lap belt works, heat works. It's really clean on the inside, a little bit dirty for me crawling in and out. Controls. This is a two speed machine. Speed change is right here. This does have the auto level, two speed indicator, AC and air conditioning. Start it up. It's got 1216 hours on it as of right now. Good inside the cab. 
windshield wiper works. There's the bucket auto level off on hazards two speed indicator. This locks and unlocks your front hydraulics for the bucket. AC and heat. Fan blows the well. Cab lights.
All right, that was our video. Appreciate you watching. Thanks.